I, yeah. forgot, <laughs> I forgot I had eggnog and I'm so happy. <laughs> Is the eggnog restorative? Yeah, it's lukewarm. Delicious. It's got a kind of like... I really can't describe what the flavor of it is. Egg. Like, I want to say minty, but it's not mint. It's like a ginger flavor. It's a, it's a spiced flavor. Yeah, a spicy flavor. A spicy. Oh, it's underwater. Oh, that's pretty. It's very... Yeah, that's what I like about the, these games is just how... It's just like pure geometric art. Yeah. It's like a James Terrell exhibition. It is. Oh my gosh, we should play Bubsy. Yeah, I mean, that was the genesis of this whole thing. I remember years ago. Well, not Playing years ago, Bubsy? maybe, but... Yeah, like, that was like, oh, I, I wanna... I want an excuse to, like, play Bubsy and then get something else out of it. Yeah. And maybe some other people to get something out of it. And laugh little at our funny little poo jokes. A little treat for everyone. I love Bubsy so much. I think that the Bubsy 3D game... Is... I know this game extremely well. <laughs> I know this game extremely well. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta put that What's clip What's his name in. again? Ulilio. Ulilio. Yeah. I love him. And he I don't does. know what he's up to now. I don't know, yeah. I would love to have him on the channel. <laughs> yeah. For sure. Fan of the show. Fan big of the fan show. of the show. We're a big fan of Ulilio's. Oh, think. honestly. We should have him on and to talk about his book. Where he, he describes colors and hexadecimal values. Oh, yeah, yeah. I forgot about that. I didn't realize that was in a book. I didn't even know he had a book. I thought he just did that as a general practice. Uh, he has like a novel where he does that a lot. It's very strange. Interesting. Oh shit. My kindred spirits, because I, um, this isn't even a joke. Like my favorite color is um, like zero 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 FF, zero 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 FF. You could probably tell blue. you all about zero zero zero. You'll know FF. the blue. It's the blue that we use for the like psyop.exe um, uh... blue, and it's also the blue I use for like the um, model traders YouTube channel. Slash record label stuff. Oh man, check it out. Soft plug. What? Well, I'm plugging the bigger channel here. Yeah, I know. I'm just saying it's a soft plug. You, you plugged it so soft softly. Cock. Let's go. Let's what are go, you let's doing? Go. Oh! What am I doing? You're waiting. Yeah, I was, what, are you, what are you saying? What shouldn't I do? That's what the black chappies don't understand. <laughs> you've you've, if you've you got too something. much departed in your brain. I know, right it's just infested me. I like Matt Damon in that movie. Matt Damon's good. Matt Damon. You know what I was thinking about? I couldn't put my finger on why I didn't like it, but Nutmeg has like the texture of sand, like beach sand. Yeah, it's pretty rough, but yeah, the taste is nice. I'm getting like, I'm tripping from the nutmeg. Oh no. Oh. I'm seeing the hat man. Don't have, do you have a, a dry throat and Symptoms of not make behavior. Damn, this is a tricky level. It's kind of tricky, but I think you just have to hold forward. Basically, it's not. You just can't stop. You otherwise, have to hold you hold the line. I, th I feel like I could absolutely get that in one jump. You ready? Imagine if you were like walking in the city and you um. Oh, oh no, I'm not even close. Imagine if you're just like walking in the city and there's like a crowd like um, surrounding a building and they're all like, don't jump, don't do it. And then everyone just screams and you see like a ball fall down and there's like a little monkey, monkey in inside. It? I would love that. And the that. monkey goes like, <laughs> <laughs> I would absolutely love that. Yeah. The whole crowd would like it too. Because the monkey would be safe. A and, yeah, he'd be perfectly safe. The monkey would be fine. It'd be great. It'd be a great. He would just relief. like respawn back at the top of the building. And he'd keep on doing it again and again. Over and over again. And then it would be a bit oh, like Sisyphus. A bit worried about this monkey now. Fuck. That's Sorry. like that reminds me of in Jam. Remember the guy who commits suicide by jumping <laughs> yeah. off the first floor building. So he could change his mind halfway yeah. through if he wants. He didn't change his mind though. Oh uh, yeah. Pretty smart. Pretty wicked smart way to, to do <laughs> smart. it. Smart. Yeah, it's quite smart. <laughs> My boy's wicked smart. I'd love to live in Boston and go to a, like a, a college bar and be like, yeah, I bet you learned that in the first year, of whatever. I bet people do that all the time and it's yeah, insufferable. They that scene. Yeah, I would go to Fenway Park and uh, 
And watch the Red Sox. Watch the Red Sox, but I'd also do it. I think I haven't seen this movie, but there's a see the Green. Giant. There's a movie where Jimmy Fallon plays the lead, which really? is hilarious in itself. And he like but, laughs every half minute. <laughs> I really need a drink. <laughs> no, what is he, it's what's a movie. His role? It's his... a it's a baseball movie where he plays someone who's like obsessed with baseball, and uh, his you. girlfriend can't stand it. It's really, but I think he's a Boston fan, right? But I've just seen the the like DVD cover and it's hilarious. Get I didn't up, know. Get up a picture in this video. Yeah, I'll like, put it it's up. very. Do you know what it's called? I'll find. I it. can't actually remember what it's called. Just look up Jimmy Fallon baseball movie. I didn't know he could act. I don't know. If he's he a triple can. threat. He can act. He can sing. He can dance. Can he sing? Really? Who can't dance? Honestly, what's the what's the big? Oh. What's the big whoop? I can dance. Big whoop. Big whoop. I can dance. It's me, Pee-wee Herman. <laughs> Did, he died recently, didn't he? He died quite recently. Paul Rubens? He died uh, masturbating in a movie I was going to say that. <laughs> you beat me to it. He died wonking off. <laughs> <laughs> My friends were in Berlin and um, they saw this shop called um, Rizzy Wonka. I think it was called. <laughs> I, I'll put a photo up. I can find it. That's very good. Rizzy yeah. Wonka? Oh, very good. Very good. Very Rizzy good. Wonka. Very good Karate oh. Kid. Yes, Sensei. Oh. oh, Karate Kid with Chris Chen. I would absolutely watch that. <laughs> I wasn't that. really meaning to do that, but it just kind of slipped out. I would absolutely... I would watch that without a hesitation. And oh. I just won. Why am I painting this damn house? I put my, I put my name in a hat, and I just won. I love that. Chris so Chen. much promise. So much of promise. So much of very, very exciting character. This is racist. Can't wait to see development of Quickville. Yeah. Hmm. Ten, nine, oh shit. Eight, seven, six, five, four. You got it. Let's go. Was that just racist? It was kind of funny. That though. was pure. The Chris Chan critique is pure funny. racism. <laughs> I like that. Thanks. Can you imagine if Kant was a SJW guy? Ready? He was an incel. Go. Uh. He was probably a voluntary cell. Yeah, I can see that. What do you call that? Vol cell. Is that a name as yeah. well? That's such a funny. You're gonna die. Yeah. That's such a funny. That was a funny. Vol cell. Vol cell. I am an Italian in cell. <laughs> Vol cell. In cell. In cellette. Buon pensiero in cell. Is my name. An Italian is my game. I am the most Italian incel ever. Incel's the name and not having sex is the game. Ooh. Um. Oh, it'd be funny if he was like uh, an Italian guy that was an incel, but he, he, he like really felt like he was a part of the community. Yeah. But he has to do a post one day on 4chan or whatever. He's like, sorry guys. I had sex with my mom. <laughs> I, can't, I can't call myself an incel anymore. Christian, in a way, was like a proto incel, but wasn't really victim to a lot of that sort of culture. Because um, they've always been on the fringes of things, you know. Yeah. In terms of actual engagement with a culture, a digital culture or something. Yeah, I don't know how to characterize Christian. Definitely an incel, but do you know what I mean? Like, the, what, you know how there's incel? like a specific community of incels, you know? Yeah. Like Chris Chan was never that. But Chris Chan found Chandler. his heart sweet in the end. But wasn't his heart sweet his mother? Yeah. That's a bit sweet. <laughs> That's it a took bit him 40 sweet. years to find his heart sweet. I'm going the easiest route on this one. I can't be This bothered. is similar to what I was thinking of. I think you have to do all of these though to get the um all the bananas in the level. Ah. Uh. That's why. That's the I benefit see. of yeah. learning how to do the hard one. Learn the ropes. That's the benefit of... If you were doing that, would you start with the thinnest one? Yeah, so that you can... Uh, yeah, probably. Ready? Twist and spin. This pop filter is so warm on my face. I know, it radiates <laughs> heat, really... doesn't it? Yeah. I think it's cause also because it just bounces back the air you breathe onto it. But I don't feel like they're even that necessary. Like, I'd be curious to hear what the difference is um, without the it. pop filter. We could make that experiment. Yeah. I've tried. And I found it somewhat negligible. 
Oh, I have no clue how to do any of that shit. I hope I come across all right. Yeah, you. I've, I'm an no, amateur. You, there's been no issues with you so far. Thanks. Except your fat cock hanging out all the time. Well, that's not an audio problem. That's true. It's, it's lucky the department. video's not on, because otherwise people would be complaining. YouTube wouldn't be putting these up. Yeah. There was a time early on in YouTube's history where there was, um, where porn was on there. Was porn ever allowed? I like softcore like, stuff. I guess like uh, yeah, people like true. soap bath video. It still know. is. Is it? Yeah. I, don't know. I, I reckon if you, if you looked into YouTube, like big boobs, you'd find girls with cleavage out easily. Hmm. 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 I doubt it. <laughs> <laughs> you do it very well. I can it's only do that noise. One. Can I you think. do him saying something? Can you do him saying like, so. uh, take the photos of me off the internet? Oh, uh, yeah, maybe. Can you maybe. do the one? Can you do the the video where he's like, um, I never had autism. I love my parents and I have a full time job. This was all a prank. <laughs> Have you seen that? Oh yes. <laughs> that is that from the era when he was wearing like the um the denim vest and the like sunnies? Yeah, like, yeah, that's so, yeah. so good. <laughs> it's true. See, that, like you can't write comedy that good. Like yeah. that is just like I love someone uploaded funny. it to YouTube though with just like Chris Chan good ending and yeah, then like yeah. plays this like music after it. It's so funny. So funny. I think um that definitely was like the golden age of Chris Chan before a lot of kind of let's let's say some negativity got involved. So I think bad. there was always a kind of bad element, though. Yeah. Like, just as a spectacle. Like, someone's life becoming a spectacle can't be good. I think ever. he's, like, the most documented person in history. It is interesting, the, the idea of, like, people do histories of this person just using stuff from the internet. Like, Geno Samuel's series. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, but yeah, there's, like, all of this. There's millions of hours of documentation of this one person's life. It's very it's crazy, strange. Well, that's the thing. Like, that's if you go on like the wiki, to be alive. You, can, you can find information for every single day, basically. For that he's been alive. about forty years, yeah, roughly. Well, every, everything alive. that's documented, yeah. But they, even as a child, there's documented stuff as well. So it's like the gaps. There's not a lot of gaps you have to fill in. Like, I I don't know about this, but I feel like the the extent of which there's like any sort of in quotes like lost media or like lost information about Chris Chan. Like, I think it'd be pretty sparse. Should I try the hard one? Let's that's, that's have a bit of fun. Come with on, it. yeah. And get this one. Come on, laddie. Oh, shit. That is hard. I think you have to know when. You've got to time it just at like a frame perfect. I reckon your strat was working when you oh, were. Oh, shit. Oh. Is there a harder one than that? I don't think there is. I think this is the hardest one on this level. Oh, shit. Ah, uh, well. I'm giving up that one. That one's too hard. Yeah. That's okay. 8 out of 57 bananas. Is that just for this world or for the level? Just for the level. There's 57 bananas in that level. In that one level. But some of them are bunches. So some of them are like oh, 6 yeah, I guess in so, one. Yeah. Seems like a lot. Yeah, there's a 22 lot. 22 in this, that, I mean, yeah. That makes sense. Oh. A giant spinning comb. Every man's nightmare. Every monkey in yeah, a wall's nightmare. that freaks me out when I see a giant spinning comb in the middle of the night. Yeah. Oh. Approaching you on a dark street. Oh, stop. Stop with that. Oh, stop. Oh, stop. Your big comb. Oh, stop it with Your that. fucking comb. That could be a slur. Cuomo. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh. Slap, I slap my knee. Slap at a knee. I slap it in my knee in anticipation. <laughs> in anticipation. I'm gonna get every fucking banana on this shit. Oh, they got rid of the um the little blue stickers that were on the bananas. Do you remember they used to have oh, blue was that stickers on, the, on them? On the GameCube one? I believe so, yeah. This doesn't look familiar. I don't think this is like the GameCube one. I think these are new levels I in think this they part. Are. But that's okay. If anything, it's great. Yeah, something a little bit different. So it's not the classic that the people want, though. You see, people want the classics. What do you think the most popular pizza flavor is? I got flavor every is? single banana, I just want to say. That I saw, very good. What's the most popular pizza Margarita, flavor? Margarita, the classic. Margarita or pepperoni? Yeah, classics. Pepperoni. 
Ooh. Beehive. Ready. What is it kind of? Oh, beehive. Oh, please, beehive. Um, yeah, are there any other Christians? Uh, also, does, Liquid Chris? does, does, does she go by Christine now? Still? Yeah. I feel like that. That's. I think like they them pronouns are probably the safest, because um, there's a lot of tricky stuff navigating the waters of Christine's gender. Because they are. Because ever you know, changing. Well, also a they, they identify as like a woman, but it's like, I think Chris Chan's even admitted that it's like for nefarious purposes. Like it's not like oh authentic. God. I don't know. Like, yeah, that's kind of murky, murky waters there. I think. What's but, right? Do you have to respect the the um, pronoun preferences of a tyrant? Well, that's what people. <laughs> the great tyrant of history, Chris Chan. I mean, people say that though. I think that's a kind of. I, I sympathize with that because they're like, oh, you know, someone could be a piece of piece of shit, but it's no excuse to like misgender them or anything. So yeah, yeah, no, yeah, I, I kind that. of, I'm not, I that don't have sense. a particularly strong opinion either way on this. Yeah. I, Chris Chan is probably the only person I, I misgendered her actively. Not, I shouldn't say actively as if I'm like, tr you know, well, I think it's trying to a, as in a like, malicious way, but. I think it's a good example of someone that a lot of people do fall into that, like, well, I misgender them maybe, but I don't feel like I have any obligation to because they've done wrong in some way. Yeah. Like, because of the. This is someone who's. Uh, it's like when Kevin Spacey came out mother, as gay, right? didn't? Yeah. So it's like, do we? Do you have to? Do you have to obey their preferences for other things? No, uh, no. yeah. Oh, oh, Mario. Hola. Do you think Mario? Mario should have. Because this is Sega. Mario so, should have bodily autonomy. I agree. Yeah, Mario should have. Mario for the Mario's and. <laughs> <laughs> Luigi for the Luigi's. <laughs> I'm just saying, Mushroom Kingdom for the Mario's. <laughs> Alright, I have to go pee. Can you promise me something? Yeah. Can you promise me you'll be really funny while I go to the toilet? I can promise to tell a few jokes. Alright, good. I'll be right back. Um, I don't have any actual jokes, but I can maybe come up with a humorous story about a monkey and a banana. So, there was this monkey and this banana and let's just say that the monkey was getting inappropriate ways lots of uh families and that were unbesightly to the public for weeks because they were scared of the monkey's violent behavior because they and then uh the other monkey that was in the enclosure for the monkey took a revenge killing i don't know <laughs> i don't know that's for you not to know and the viewers to find out.